Hey guys, Cripple Critic here, uh, back for another episode of Broken Age. Uh, last time we did it, we met this awesome guy named Curtis. He was weird and funny and very into art, uh, and apparently in this world trees can talk and they hate humans, but that's to be expected. Uh, yeah, so we've got to find some wood. I guess this tree isn't going to be enough. Uh, so Curtis can make us something. Maybe to kill Mog Chatra, who knows. So let's do it. Hello, Shellmound. Looks like Mog Chatra hasn't gotten here yet. Hmm. Excuse me, uh, Mayor? What? Mayor? Why did you say that? Because you look like a mayor. Because you look like a mayor. Mm, I have to admit you're not the first person to tell me that. But alas, I am merely Maiden's Feast Marshal Dune. A humble man of the people. For now. <laughs> the bucket hat. What is that? What the heck? Hey, about your bucket hat. What? What about it? It looks awesome. It looks great on you. Very fancy. What? Fancy? But I'm a man of the people. Uh. I'm never going to win this election if I come off as haughty and elite. Hey, take this away from me. Alright, I don't know why we have it, but... Thank you, child. I'm firing my stylus tomorrow. So, you're running for mayor of Shellmound? My hopes and dreams, just sand castles built too close to an angry sea. I had hopes, child, but this construction debacle under my marshal ship has washed them all away. Uh... When is Mark Chakra supposed to get here? Any minute! So much to do! I gotta enter! I need to enter the Maiden's Feast! Child, at this point, we may not even have a Maiden's Feast. <laughs> not that you have the right scent for it anyway. Uh... I think I smell bad? Are you saying I smell bad? No! Oh, heavens no, child! You smell like birthday cake and fluffy clouds. <laughs> With a hint of fresh pine. Ooh, and a dangerous undernote of snake, I believe. Yep, that clouds. happened. But that's just not the sort of aroma that hooks the big fish. Talk to your grandmother. I'm sure she has a fragrance recipe she'll share with you. This guy's nose is, like, oddly specific. Like, he knew I went in clouds. Do clouds smell? I don't think they do. <laughs> Did you say there might not be a maiden's feast? The sea? She is angry this day. I'm trying to build the offering arena, but the waves keep washing us away. Yeah, I mean... Why do you build the offering arena so close to the ocean? Uh, because that's where the sand is. <laughs> Logic. Better let you get back to the feast. Yes, yes. These maidens aren't going to serve up themselves. Yeah, that sounds terrible. Alright, let's talk to these maidens. Probably gonna be all stuck up. Hi. You maidens getting ready for the maidens feast? <laughs> nice costumes, girls. Nice costumes. fishermen in the village, so they're pretty good at tying lures. We had to use every hook in town, but it was worth it. Her eyelashes. <laughs> uh, I want to be in the Maiden's Feast. I want to be in the Maiden's Feast. Of course you do, poor thing. But shell maidens are chosen only after a long 
period of qualifying events. Really? Also, our dads are pretty powerful. Also, can I tell you something? Just as a friend. <laughs> oh my god, yes, just as a friend. <laughs> you just don't smell right, girl. Oh, I'd want a friend to tell me that. Oh, your dad invent toast is real too. Isn't somebody gonna miss those hooks? Not as much as they're gonna miss us. Not that <laughs> much. Cry, girl. <laughs> you made him nervous. Yeah, nervous that Marshall Dune isn't gonna get the offering arena ready before Mog Chopper gets here. Oh, I can't believe our dad's donated so much to his campaign. Yeah, they probably don't wonder this. Don't you guys ever wonder if there's another way? To save the town, I mean. Um, this is how it's always been done. <laughs> yeah, they figured out how to do it a long time ago, so we wouldn't have to think about it. Nice logic. Hey, can I have some of that perfume? <laughs> That's not perfume. That's a proprietary luring compound known as Beast Hooker. It's irresistible <laughs> to moths. Beast hooker, huh? Hey, can I have some of your beast hooker? That's better, but no, you can't. <laughs> Sorry, you suck. <laughs> just one squirt. How about just one little squirt? Sorry, if I'm not gonna give any to my best friend, Drusilla, I'm certainly not gonna give any to you. I said I don't want any. I don't use performance enhancers. Hmm. Hey, maidens, I'm going to kill Mog Chathra. Ha! Huh. Not half as hard as I'm gonna kill it. I'm already killing it in this outfit. In this outfit. See you, maidens, later. Yeah, bye. bye. See ya. These fishing poles are useless. All the hooks have been stolen. Oh, by those girls with their outfits. It's empty. These seagulls seem to really like fish guts. Looking at this chum truck makes me really happy I grew up in a baking town instead of a fishing town. I just hope my baking town is still standing. So... I don't know why, but... I'm gonna try to get some of this chum. As much as I would like some chum, I don't think it's smart to carry it around in an open container with those gulls <laughs> around. Alright, alright. She wants some, by the way, so I'd love some. Oh, oh wood, good. So Alright, let's go back to Curtis, because he rocks the his house. Give him some wood. I mean, not in that way, although, you know, I could. But, yeah. <laughs> so, Curtis, here's some wood. Check it out. Non talking wood. Oh, and it's so smooth. Mm -hmm. Oh, man. I feel a stool <laughs> coming on. What? Wow. Oh, um, whew. That's a relief. Tell me about it. I feel ten times better. Thanks for helping me get that out of my system. Wow. I want you to have it. Really? Thanks. No problem. I like to spread my sandwich. Seriously? Enough of the joke. Alright, I got a stool. It's pretty. You know, that Curtis looks like such a slacker. But he sure can bust out a solid stool. <laughs> I'm standing right there, by the way. You sure you don't want this stool? No. It might start talking any minute. For real. Alright. Hey, here's a thing. Need a bucket? That would be a great bucket for collecting sap. If I weren't too freaked out to collect sap from those talking trees. See, I should go do that. Wow. 
why do I need sap exactly? It's kinda odd. So. Quite a nose you got there. Don't touch it. You'll make me. What? Barf? No. Ick. I was going to say sneeze. <laughs> hey, can I have some of your sap? You're just like the rest of them. You want to bleed us dry, steal all our thick, luscious, and incredibly useful fluids. You humans make me want to throw them. Do but it. I won't do it because I refuse to give you the pleasure of my sap. I'll let you get back to your screaming. Yeah, please leave before I vomit, you foul, rootless stump. Foul, rootless stump? Oh, I'm gonna get that sap. Just you wait. Okay, guys, um, it's a good place to stop. So, yeah, we got a stool and saw some weird people in Shell Mound. Uh, but, alright, I'll see you later. Thanks for watching. Bye.